Hey guys, guess what? I got a screensaver as my wallpaper. Woohoo! Now I'm going to show you how to do this. <clears throat> it's fairly easy to do, but all you need to um, have basically is you need to have the administrator account enabled to actually do this. Now it's very easy to do. All you need to do is go to um, control panel. Now this is the first step in doing it anyways. Go to the control panel home. I'm going to go to user accounts and family safety. User accounts again. Then you're going to go to the turn user account control on or off. Now be aware that this only works for Vista. So you're going to go to that. Then you're going to disable the UAC or user account control. Then hit OK. Then you're going to restart. And then once you restart, you're going to go to your command prompt. I already have one open. You're going to go to your command prompt and you're going to type net users administrator make sure the AN administrator is um, capitalized space forward slash active colon yes then just hit enter and you should have your administrator account active just log off and just log in that and then you could just delete the account that you're on and you could you know, have the option of keeping the files or deleting the files that are on that account so you don't have to worry about that but once you've done that now let me just quit this screen so real quick so I can show you uh, where is it? where is that? let's see where it is alright now all you need to do is go back to a command prompt once you've done all that then you're going to type in the screensaver that you want for example, I'm going to use ribbons, so I'm going to type in ribbons.scr space. You're going to have to type something else too, just for this to work. Then you're going to type forward slash p65552. Then you're going to hit enter. And now you should have your screensaver working as your wallpaper, which is pretty cool. Now, I believe this doesn't use a lot of RAM. Hold on, let me try this real quick. Go to Task Manager. Performance. Wait, Processes. Excuse me. Let's scroll down to ribbons.scr. It uses 11 megabytes of RAM, but it's not, it's not a lot. But yeah, this is how you could set a screensaver as your wallpaper. Now, if you have any questions about this, um, send me a message and I'll sure to get back um, to you. And if you like my videos, please subscribe. Thanks.